So society thinks that a tech just probably counts your pills in the back of the pharmacy, but of course that's a stereotypical way to look at it. Once you become a tech, once you pass your initial exam, and then you can move forward to become a chemo tech, IV tech, compounding, and there is point of care now added after COVID. Now technicians also give out immunizations. You can run simple tests at clinics or also at CVS Health Hub. So there is more avenues that you can grow into and then Baton Rouge just added one called a nuclear pharmacy tech. The labs are very important. Now once we have a realistic stimulation lab on campus, we can show students that in the real world when you go out, this is what you're going to be doing. Nothing is going to be a surprise. The only thing that's going to change for a student is a software. Other than that, everything is set up to a real world pharmacy setting, which kind of gives them a confidence to work when they step their foot into pharmacy day one. We have worked with these employers. Pharmacy is a very small world. They know how we do things and how we train them. Not just that, but our program is accredited by ASHP. So besides something, besides ABHAS, we do have an extra accreditation that kind of puts us on the map where we do produce quality text that comes out of Fortis College.